hello hello welcome to my channel and today i have been doing this i'm <laughs> making this art journal spread and i really love it i love the vibrant colors and i love the composition and all the tiny details so it was really messy but fun to make and um, yeah it was a lot of things once again from stamperia uh, the picture is from Stamperia and the stencils, uh, a few of them anyway. But I'm starting with, uh, this is my homemade art journal. So I'm starting with um, a layer of transparent gesso first. And then I'm going to use some different distress inks. And this stencil is, is actually from Panduro. It's my workplace, a hobby store, a craft store in here in Sweden, Norway, Denmark. And here is another stencil that I believe is from Stamperia. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, because I never, <laughs> never, you know, I just take them out of the package and then I don't save it because it's too much hassle for me. It has to be quick. And this is my newest uh, stencil from Stamperia. Uh, and I really like it. It kind of circuit circuits and things. So I'm just adding it with different distress inks in brown and black. And now I'm using the same stencil again with some modeling modeling paste. And I had a rough idea what I was going to do, but no clear idea. So now I'm using my sprays from Dilutions. And this is a really nice color. And it's called, let's see, Pure Sunshine, I think. And I really love it. And I'm just um, <laughs> splashing a bit with the other one. It's melted chocolate, the brown one. And of course some, not of course, but some cheesecloth that I'm going to use today. And I really like working with um, 3D things in my uh, works, but I usually don't use it in my art journaling. So I'm just um, spraying the cheesecloth with my vibrant turquoise from Dilutions also. And I want to add it kind of in the middle um, horizon. <laughs> I think it's horizontal, but I'm not sure. And I'm also going to add uh, a lot of black sewing thread. And I'm using today my um, gloss gel medium to adhere everything. So it's really strong, adhesive. And I don't mind the glossy effects today. So I'm just using my spatula. And I'm going to use some paper scraps that I have stamped on. And I'm going to color them in a bit so they will match better. I'm using Distress Inks and my Dilution Spray again. So here I want uh, some saying or a quote. And I have uh, some metallic ornaments also, also that I want to use. And yeah, I'm just trying what looks best. And these are actually, I think they are from... Uh, Bhutan, but I'm not sure because I received them in a package when I was subscribing the um, uh, what's the name of those uh, oh my god I can't remember them once again uh, scrapbook uh, something something from the US and they send as uh, so you have a subscription and they send one I think once a month uh, some things that they have um, yeah, put together but I don't subscribe anymore because it's too expensive for me here in Sweden with um, shipping 
and I'm deciding that I'm going to use this um, woman <laughs> cutout. Uh, it's from a paper, also from Stamperia that I had. I uh, <laughs> almost forgot that I had a lot of Stamperia papers lying around, so I wanted to use them. So I'm just, you know, trying to make some composition here. Some more metallics and some more paper scraps that I'm just adding. Please uh, tell me if you know what they are called, the scrapbook company that sends uh, the packages because I can't remember anymore. I'm also using some yellow sequins, I think they are pronounced sequins. And I'm just going to stamp a bit with my homemade stamp here and with some vintage sepia brown color. So I'm actually going to use the papers that I used for spraying on uh, because I don't want any waste. So I'm just punching out two flowers that I want to add because I wanted some more of the turquoise color, um, especially on the right page. So I am also gonna add some gemstones or yeah you know bling <laughs> to them with a golden color. So that is it actually and I really like it. It's a lot of things happening but I love the colors as I said before and I hope you could follow my kind of chaotic process somewhat and uh, I hope you enjoyed and I hope you will try something maybe similar and and please leave a comment for me uh, it's really appreciated and a like of course important and subscribe to my channel if you if you enjoyed it so um, I have made actually two uh, videos today, so busy busy. So thank you and bye.